To write a letter, select the stationery from your pockets and then choose write a letter. And don't forget, you must address it to Daisy. I'm counting on you, yes? Okay. Choose the stationery and then write a letter. Oh, I see. Oh, la, 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 la. We'll borrow Daisy. Confirm. Dear Daisy, thank you. Thanking you. For patronizing I and she space M Y space S H O P period. I space M in forming M I N G Y O U T H A T that T H E R E um there is a S A L E G O I N G O N Thanking you for patronizing my shop. I am informing you that there is a sale going on. Sincerely, Tom no. Confirm. Okay, let's go to the post office. Gosh. This is the town post office. What can I help you with? Send mail. So where would you like to send your mail? To Wilboro. Okay, I'll take it from here. Do you have any other letters you need to send out? Nope. Thank you for visiting and please come again. So that's done. 
I sent the mail to Daisy. Let's go back to Tom Nook's shop. Did you send it out? Ah, very good, yes! That seemed to take a little too long for my liking, but at least you got it done. Everyone in Willboro really likes letters, so if it didn't go out, I'd be in trouble. Hmm. So next, I need you to deliver a carpet. Make it snappy this time, please. I need you to deliver this carpet to Avery. And just because you don't think I'm watching, don't go taking detours and chatting about. Hmm? Yes, just let me know when you finish that delivery. Avery here. Wow. <laughs> Okay. So this is Avery's house. <laughs> Is there something you want to talk about? Because I'm waiting. Delivery. Carpet delivery. Wow, you sure made it here fast. Once I heard you were handling the delivery, I sort of expected I wouldn't see my stuff tomorrow. <laughs> no offense, of course, it's just that it's your first job and all. I wish I had something to dip you with. Oh, yeah, you may not need something like this yet, but would you like one of my hand-me-downs? It's just my old mosaic tile, but it's yours. For a small town shop owner, Tom Nook is pretty ambitious. Like, did you know he changes the stock of items to the shop every day? There isn't much in there at any given time, but if you don't like what's there, just wait a day. But once your job starts paying off, there are a few things you'd like to buy. Eh? You should start checking things out now to see what old Nook is talking at the moment. Welcome back! Yes, welcome back! Good job! Looks like you're starting to get the knack of for this whole working for a living thing. Hmm? Keep up the good work. I like what I see. Next, I need you to deliver this watering can to Daisy. Oh, and don't go using my customers' things as your own when you should be delivering them, huh? If you want to water some flowers, you can buy your own watering. <laughs> Please get a move on and let me know when you're done. Yes? That's easy. I know who's Daisy already. So let's deliver this watering can to Daisy. Hey Daisy! So, Eden, is there something you want here for you? The watering can. 
Thanks for the delivery. Now I can break up those poor wilted flowers in my garden. By the way, I wanted to ask you about this letter. Did you write it? Uh, <laughs> oh, yes. I absolutely love receiving letters. And I'm not the only one. I mean, who doesn't enjoy finding a special note in the mailbox? I like to share the letters I receive, just to share a little bit about myself and my friends. Except things get a little tense when someone reads a letter with secret details about my personal life. It's not exactly the most private system, so I just won't send any private information. Oh gosh, I'm sorry. I'm keeping you from working, aren't I? You'd better go, Ed, and thanks again for the delivery. Yes, I'm not supposed to stay. Hey, where are you going? Here's the bridge. Done, Mr. Nook. Welcome back. Good job. Yes, yes. Let's see now. Your next job will be... I know. I just remembered. There's a bulletin board near the town hall. Yes? You know the one? I need you to write an ad for the shop on that very bulletin. I'll leave the wording up to you, but make sure it's something snazzy that all the young kids will like. Remember, lots of people will see it, so don't write anything that will make us look bad. Alright, hop to it. Come back afterward. <gasps> Can I write? Don't fuss over it too much. Just jot something eye-catching and witty and come back speedily. Hmm? So we have stationaries, carpets, seeds, saplings. What is this? Tools, sweets. What is this? Those are for customers. You are work here, so this is no time to shop. Hmm?
Nook's Granny. What is the name of the shop? <laughs> Let me check the name of his shop. Shit. Shop. Let me check the name of Tom Nook shop. I can't even see it. Nook's Cranny, something like that. Yeah, Nook's Cranny, okay. Ah uh, yes, welcome back. Did you write the message? Yes, yes, very good job. So that means you're done. Yes, done. Those were all the good oh those were all the odd jobs I had lying around. And since I don't have anything left for you to do, that means your part-time employment is over. Hmm? Hmm your home loan? Yes, yes, of course, I'm going to need you to pay that back in its entirety. And your part-time work here thus far, you've made 1,400 bills. So that means you only owe another 18,400 bills on the home loan. Yes, not so much, is it? But there's no work left here for you, so I guess you'll have to find another way to pay off the loan. You could help people in town sell things you don't need or do any number of activities to make money. And if you want to sell stuff, bring it here. Hmm? I'll make sure you get a good price for it. Oh yes, you can pay off your loan by wiring me money from the bell point in the town. In the town hall. And when it's all paid off, come see me about home renovations. Yes. Your house is a little small right now, but I can make it bigger and much more comfortable to live in. So, um, go work here in the shop and everything, and don't forget to do all your shopping right here. I'm all done with work now. I'm free. <laughs> um, I can sell apples to Mr. No. What time is it? No. Oh, it's closed. Okay. Well, it's open. Hours of operation are 8 a.m. To, to 10 p.m. Oh, it's night. So it's time for me to go to bed.
Hey, Daisy. Oh, hello there, Eton. Um, Eton, do you have a sack? I want to get your opinion about something here. I was planning on wearing this to the city, but I don't know what do you think. Perfect. Really? Oh, what a relief. That makes me feel so much better. I had no idea what I was going to do if I couldn't pull this outfit outfit off I'm glad you've given me the stamp of approval now I can go out with confidence find my stupid toothbrush and it's really stressing me out so I'm walking to calm down say Eton you have a camera and stuff don't you cameras are crazy easy to use you just have to press one to take an awesome picture and then you can press two or camera to see the picture you took so like if you see any trendy boys in the city Totally snap a picture for me, okay? Mm. Mm -hmm. And try taking pictures with friends who are visiting from other towns. Now you can post them to the We Message board from the post office in Town Hall. That's like um, a cool high tech service offered by Willboro Beach. Yes! Would you like to quit now? Safe and quit. <laughs> <laughs> 